Hey everybody, Blind Way back. I'm Aaron. I'm Calvin. And we have another Daredevil video. We are still working on getting them out before Jessica Jones, so yep. we'll, we're, we're working on it. Yeah. <laughs> Trust us, we're, we we're working on them. Um, last episode, we got to... Well, the episode before last episode, we met Fisk. We we saw Fisk, and but he had a line. I feel like this last time we met, we really the Wilson. met. We met the, true, we met the Kingpin. We met we met Kingpin. We met Wilson Fisk last episode. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, last episode I feel like was kind of slow. You know what I mean? It was a but, slow build, but it gave a lot of. Uh, it kind of fed into like who Wilson Fisk is a lot. You know? Yeah. So I, I did like that. I enjoyed the show. Even though a lot of times, like, you're watching, like, superhero shows, and, like, you get one of those, like, more drama type of episodes, and it's like, well, what this, what, what's going on? Just, I want to see some stuff happen. But I felt like last time, like, even though he was, like, on a date, like, most of the episode, it felt like Wilson was on a date with Vanessa, and I'm like, all right, why is Wilson, why is Wilson doing this? Yeah. Isn't he a bad guy? Why is he just, like, yeah, he, he I, just wants to be a happy bad guy yeah. with the wife? I expected to see more Wilson Fisk from... Matt Murdock's point of view. Like, oh, he's a really bad man. He's doing all these terrible things. We need to stop him. But instead, it was from the perspective of the tender, seemingly caring and calm uh, kingpin. Until you piss him off and interrupt his date. <laughs> Until you see what he's actually like it when was, he's not restraining himself. It was, it was himself. nice, yeah. Like, a lot of the superhero shows, like, you know, in Arrow, most of the time, like, villains, you don't have an episode... That's geared towards meeting and learning about them. Yeah, you learn about them through watching your main hero do figure stuff. out stuff. So about, it was interesting yeah. having like a Daredevil episode more focused on Fisk. I felt, or at least yeah. half and half. You know? Yeah, no. All righty. Well, let's see what's going to be happening in this episode of Daredevil. Yeah, I'm watching oh. Game of He does very good at acting like blind. His, yeah, like his eyes don't do anything. He just kind of stares off in the distance and stuff. Yeah, doesn't really look at anything. Uh, where's your brother? This is a thing I was going to ask you. What's their play here? Blame Daredevil? I mean, they still need the Russians. They don't have the infrastructure yet. Yeah. I'm just still like, what's I... their play? Oh, that's Daredevil's mask, isn't it? Man in the mask. It doesn't even look like his mask. It's like a, a proper, like, a Zorro mask. It didn't have holes in it. It was just like a black bandana, wasn't it? Well, it was, like, tied in the back. Yeah, he ties like, his in the back. What? It, no, like, wraps I, I around th and ties back here in I the back. I thought it was like a beanie that he just pulled down over his, like, up to his nose. No. No? No. No. That would be a shitty job. Wash the blood off my car. Watch the brain off his car. There's still a head in there. I don't think there's a head in there. They probably threw that in the river. Anyone else wondering about this? Just bobbing around. <laughs> hey. They were too unpredictable. This is from the guy taking heads off with the car door. He's got a point. That's what I thought, too. Yeah. I said it. <laughs> is that Madame Chow? Keep sending your deliveries to the Russians. I don't remember her name, but I think she has, like, the... The blind drug. When makers. this is all over, I'll assume the responsibility Remember that? and move their share. For a fair man. Madam Cow. That's her name. Madam Cow. Gow. Oh. That's one of the uh, the blind drug makers. I think so. I mean, with shades like that at night, you got to figure. You're just tired or dead. I mean, he could be tired. We hung over. All the bright city lights, no. Spins back around. Ooh. It's like Slenderman, <laughs> right? <laughs> Up in one shop for a little while. Yep. <gasps> Where'd he go, Aaron? That was a lot of time. Could just walk to the right. <laughs> I know. <laughs> From the shadows. Darkwing Duck. Oh. Oh, the wrong blind guy no. got shot. <laughs> we shot the wrong blind man. 
I saw a head. They took it. Shit. Innocent. Yeah. I mean, he made drugs. He may be innocent. He may not be innocent. I don't know. I don't know his story. Did he go down with the turtles? Oh, close. Ooh. Oh, did you see that? Man beating up the Russians again. <laughs> Man, he got a long ways away in just like the five seconds that they cut he away. Declined a... I know he. They also handcuffed him and got him to the car, and that was five well, seconds too, which isn't how long it usually takes okay. for the cops to. Oh, Look at me. I'm delicious. <laughs> Take care. <laughs> Hello, Foggy. Look at me. I'm delicious. Yeah. What you want to do? Now you can stand there and listen to everybody, right? Mm-hmm. The one way ticket to 30 years in asshole land. I'll give you some time to touch <laughs> up on those tattoos. You boys do that to yourselves at the end. Okay. Asshole land. If I give you another man, give it You have to be big. You have to be King Freaking Con. Almost. Can I represent him? You bet. Dirty cops. Mm -hmm. They're everywhere. From the top of your salon blowout to the bottom of your overpriced belts. <laughs> oh, good job. We got a soul. Hmm. I figured. Let's step a little faster. <laughs> I like Foggy. I like Foggy a lot. Another date with Vanessa. Um, that's not what he said, was it? He recommended a wine. I can only assume that. It could that just was be he wants to fucking take a drink. That could be. <laughs> no, no, Vanessa seemed pretty pissed off. Yeah. Uh oh, he's outside. Where the daredevil can get him. There's a bam, big fence there, though. Eh? But he can jump. Yeah. Screaming that arm comes your good one. We clear. Goes his knee. That leg became your good leg. What if he goes after Fisk right now? What is with Vanessa? Streets. One minute, or whoever can tell me what I can find first. The knife is one minute. Shit. I'm wanted. <laughs> Make a phone call. Want a gun? Right? <laughs> Don't think any his guns. <laughs> yeah, I know. It won't jam at all. It came to me pretty short. It's it's liquid. <laughs> we get there. Yeah. I don't know about that. I mean, I don't know. See how you have that little knot back in the back? Did you see it? No, I didn't. Ah! Sorry. I'll look more. It worked. I slept with him. Hmm. <laughs> He's like, damn, that's a good line. Oh. I'm going to write that down. Hmm. A big one. Twenty-two. Oh, Did not a big one. Reason to stay. Here's my gun. <laughs> Maybe he doesn't have a gun. Huh? He doesn't have a gun. I don't think he carries a gun. But he's still gonna show you, show her his gun. And <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hurt more. So the Russian show up right now. Damn. Uh huh. Yes, 
Explosive Fisk is right here. Can I have part of the million? <laughs> Made her D. He's got nothing better to do. Dorm room across the hall. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I really wish I knew you guys back then. <laughs> Much better off knowing us. That's <laughs> back in yeah. college. Yeah, <laughs> so mean. I'm a hell of a lot more dash. Why are there so many blind Asians? Do they have working this? Do they make them blind? They just happen to be blind? Like, you know what I mean? Maybe like, they... I'm pretty sure that whole facility is all full of blind Asians. Maybe they shipped them in from the homeland. Maybe they specifically found people who are good at handling drugs and blinded them. Poor blind guy. At least he doesn't know what's going on. Stuff got up go. Mm -mm. Bomb. Ooh! <laughs> I'm betting that was the favor he wanted from Madame Cow. Tell me what you feel. Okay. Jesus! Are you okay? Fuck. Man, there's a lot of explosions going on. He... No, those were... Those were the addresses. The four addresses? But what are they? Slums. The one place was the... Did you read about them? Vladimir and his crew. Happened to be. I think it was It was like a warehouse that he wanted burned down. I don't think it was just their slums. It was something more than that, I think. For the men that did that, they will no longer infect this city. Got them all mobilized. He grouped them up. Yeah. S settle, settle. You can get info from him. This one's clear. Mm. Cops are gonna see him now. Let them get close. Like fools. What's his plan now? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. He's caught. Uh-uh. He's... Damn it. He's caught! Damn it! What?! Let himself get caught! Damn it, Calvin. This is your fault. How uh, is it my fault? Bro. You don't know yet? I don't know. Just we'll like, have to watch the next episode like to find out. Fault. That's the first time I think we've had one where it's been like a... What? You know what I mean? Yeah. The first time I feel like it kind of ended... Well, the first episode had like the kid being kidnapped. And you're kind of like, what? And he hears the kid and you're like, oh. Yeah, but th I felt like that was more of like a... This has been like... He's got to do something. And then yeah. Like, no, I gotta know what he does t t next time. Uh, I don't know what you think of this episode. This is very interesting. Um, still, Wilson Fisk and his friend just being super puppet masters, playing everybody into their own hand and right where they want them and then just getting rid of them, not even messing around. Mm-hmm. You start thinking like, oh, well, these guys are going to do this and fuck up Fisk. Yeah. You and better watch out because he's with his girlfriend. And then this guy's betraying him, calling him, making a phone call. And actually, it's just everything they have planned in yeah. with. You know, this guy's telling him about the car. This guy's calling, saying that he's at the restaurant. This guy's doing this. Uh, it was uh, definitely a, a, a twist. <laughs> <laughs> um, the, the, I don't know. None of that really su surprised me, surprised me. Like, once the blind guy was kind of walking into the middle of all of them, like, isn't he a drug dealer? Why is he just showing up here now? Like, that's bad timing. And like, yeah. it's gotta be a, it's a bomb! And he goes, like, ah, oh, right! Yeah. But I think the biggest thing that surprised me is just Vanessa. You know, from the last episode, I felt like she was like, I don't want whatever you're a part of kind of thing. And now it's like, good, you killed the bad men. Like, fuck, he's a good man? <laughs> you know what I mean? Right. Like, he's just killing people. I feel like Vanessa would get along with uh, Matt Murdock a lot better than Claire. I mean, I, I don't think it was very fair what she said to him. I mean, I, I understand where she's coming from. She doesn't want him to become a bad man that just goes around and, and beats yeah, up people. but there's an extent of, like, this is how bad this man is. I'm going to have to be somewhat bad in order to, to take, take care him down, of it. You know? Yeah. I can't just be a goody-goody and, like, say, hey, 
apologize to all these people. Yeah, you know I, mean? I mean, lawyering can only get you so far. Yeah. You can't go to the police and tell the police that, hey, you need to find Wilson Fisk and arrest him because he owns people on the police force, you know? Yeah. At least two detectives. So, I mean, I don't know. I think it was fun, and I think we're going to have to see what happens next episode to figure yeah. out exactly what those targets were. I don't think they were slums. No, I, I agree with you now. They he just were... didn't like those property, so instead of tearing them down like construction workers, well, he decided to blow them all up. I think it was a concerted effort. <coughs> like, the one place was definitely the slums, but the other one... they didn't. He didn't blow up some crappy apartments. He blew up whatever was next to it. Which could have been where the where the Russians were. It could have been where some other bad element were, was. He said something to Vanessa, which yeah, I think was right. something along the lines of like... It didn't actually blow out underneath these are, of them. It was next yeah, to them. It was like their building blew up. Because, I mean, heck, that one place blew up. And it was trash where Vladimir and them were in. Like, there should have been more damage if it was inside the building where Foggy was. It came from... the. It was like a blast from outside. Yeah, it came from the, the windows. The it building was like a across the street. Yeah, it was like the concussive blast. It wasn't like... A bunch of fire and stuff all blowing up around him and stuff. So yeah, yeah, I agree with you. They're they're not slums. <laughs> it's just that that's the first thing that jumped in my mind, and I was like, oh, this. Uh, These places are not pretty. Blow them up. <laughs> <laughs> you were just, I was gonna let you go for as long as you wanted to go. Make sure you guys are leaving comments down below. Check out blindwave.net for all of our reactions, our let's plays, our live feeds. All that kind of stuff. You might see some stuff on there. Maybe before YouTube officially has anything. Yeah. It might happen every once in a while. It's... So just kind of keep a little eye on it. So uh, make sure you guys are checking out blindwave.net. We also have our Patreon account. If you get a chance, hop on there. Yeah, so uh, thanks to everybody who has pledged. Yeah. We've had some good... We really appreciate it. We've had some nice people that have been pledging in, so I'm... thank you very much. Um, other than that, make sure you guys check out blindwave.net. Make sure you like the video. Subscribe. And until next Daredevil, I'm Aaron. I'm Calvin. And Calvin, close your eyes and hit the button. Yeah, you got it.